Legend of Total War here with part 9 of my Westeros Total War Let's Play campaign as Stannis Baratheon's forces. On the last episode, I conquered a number of, uh, actually two of the uh, Lannister set, uh, settlements and crushed two of their fairly large armies. At the cost of, well, these guys are pretty exhausted now. Stannis is there. Uh, they're going to need some reinforcements. Either that or smaller armies to fight. Okay, now it looks like these, this guy here, Jason Malister, is making his way to King's Landing. But I'm not overly concerned. I wonder if uh, she will grant me another son. Another assassin. Probably not. Alright, well I've still got 13, uh, 14 odd thousand uh, to spend. So I might as well spend it on stuff. What I need mostly is, of course, troops. Because so, I'm clearly now the biggest threat to everyone. So I need to start crushing them. Like, big time. Okay, you guys are there. Let's keep moving. Yes. And bringing in all of them, because these guys will replenish the garrison. Got the watchtower there, so I can see within my own land, my own lands, what's going on. And Fellwood. Why not? Get some more night stables, so I can get more fucking cavalry. I don't think this region really needs it. Could use that though. And repairing that castle. Okay, that'll do. Let's move on to the next turn. These guys are probably going to attack. I'm, I don't know, somewhat not very confident about uh, beating it. They don't have a general, but. Yeah, it's gonna be a tough one to win, that one. Oh, I'm getting a phone call. I'll be right back. Alright, let's continue. Now it's just about to end the turn. What do they want? A peace treaty? Ah, hold your post. They are besieging us. Hmm. That's gonna be a tough one to win. Yes. More generals, please. Oh, right near Stannis. That's good. So we've got rioting near Runestone. Didn't really expect that. That's okay, we'll deal with it. That ought to sort it out. Hmm. Okay, so I've also got an agent here now, a merchant with a lot of freaking financial training. That's good. And he's not going to make me much money around here. Actually, that's alright. Yes, I shall trade this whistle. Let's keep him coming. Yes, my now you, you can reach here, so we'll do so. Honor and courage, soldier. We march to war. At Redford. Redford. They still didn't attack. They're trying to starve me out. We will need you there. Fuckheads. Well, the plague is over at least. Okay, seems like my faction ratings went down a bit. Either that or everyone else went up. King's Landing is under attack. That's alright. We'll sort that out eventually. This guy is going to come down to Ashford. Ashford. Yep. And we'll make some watchtowers along the way. So I can see what's going on. I mean, even if I lose King's Landing, I'll be able to retake it without any difficulty, I feel. Yeah, it shouldn't be a problem to, to stop that. Do we have Ballista Towers? No. That might have been useful, but 
it's not overly vital. Okay, these guys. Can we move out? No. Creating a mighty horde, my king. I want that want that cavalry. Shit, I don't have much money. The fuck happened to all of my cash? Uh, probably because it's uh, besieging King's Landing and Maiden Pool. And this, they can fuck off. That increases my income a bit more. That's good. All right, where are we gonna go? Where to? I think the Tullys need to be brought down a peg. So let's come over here. We've got oh, the Lannisters have taken River Run. I will make them fear you. So what's slowing me down around here? This guy here is slowing me down. Yes. Well, that's okay. Maybe I'll take Stannis over here. Let's see what they've got. We've got Brendan. Okay, Brendan Tully. We're gonna need a few forces for that. Hmm. Hedge Knights. Arch uh, Riverland Archers. What are we gonna need for this? I'm thinking two of my generals helping me out should be sufficient. So these two, they're the only other ones that can make it. Unless they come to attack, but then I'll just withdraw if that's going to be the case. I can't let this keep going like this. If they're not going to make the attack, I'll have to sally out. No general there. This general's okay. Let's see. Alright, that'll just have to do. Since I'm near broke, I can't really afford to do anything else. Let's move on to the next turn. Hope for luck. Okay, so they're selling out at Raven Tree. Okay, so this guy's got 53. I should be able to take him down with what I've got. It's going to be difficult, though. All right, let's do it. Show no mercy to our people's enemies. Attack! Our foes appear to be gaining the upper hand in this battle. Might also help to take the high ground, so let's get over there. I can move it. Looks like they're sending the hedge knights in. Okay, I can't really outrun them. Oh, but then they gave up the chase. Hang on, hang on. Let's get them just a little bit further away. Still didn't make it. I want the high ground. The high ground will help me a lot. Alright, let's do this. And their general is still a little while away. I really need to keep these casualties at a minimum here. Or else how the hell am I supposed to take down Brendan Tully? Must be good if I cut off their escape. So far so good. Haven't lost too many men. But they're coming.
on, break this piece of shit. To get right round his back. comes the Tully Prick. Okay, you are going to have to go distract those Riverland Archers. That was okay, but you need to get out of there. Because this guy's adamant about killing you. So you're making a good distraction, but not going to last too long. Looks like you got out of there without too much damage. Very good. Take the high ground, guys. Still haven't taken out those Riverland Archers. High ground there. Okay, come through that little gap there. Just walk right through it, thank you, and kill those Riverland archers. How's this going? Good. Apparently they're being defeated. Oh, apparently they're going to take victory now. Make it me fucking mind. All right. If that's the case, I need to get my guy over here to, to fight them. That's because you're bloody dicking around. Looks like we're winning. Still heaps of those Riverland archers, but it's not much you can do about that. These guys just need to die. Actually, since they are leaving their Riverland archers, we'll go back and kill them. Pray something changes in the course of battle. For defeat. I have the high ground here as well. They're kicking my ass, and I don't like that. That's it. Distract their armored spearmen as best you can. Come on, Stannis. Looks like they're trying to get him out of there. Let those armored spearmen to do anything. Ah, oh, fuck. Damn this piece of shit. It's gonna be a tough one to win this now. Okay, so there's 27 of them. I've taken out their archers at the very least. Just about. Twenty-seven of them versus forty-three of my guys, plus this here. Is that equal? 43, 50, 59. Come on, you need to bloody ram right into them. How's this going? Okay, I've got a grand total now of 55 cavalry up against uh, 24, so we outnumber them. Come on, kill us. Kill them, some of them. Good, they did. Good, this is working. They're about to be exhausted as well. Come on, hurry up. Looks like he's trying to get out of there. Come on, kill this fuck. Only 13 of them left. Come 
I need to hurry. Alright, once again, guy, you need to go kill those. Oh, their hedge knights are back. Forgot I didn't kill them all. How's this going? Oh, oh for fuck's sake. That is irritating. Six of them left. Alright, they're trying to get away again, so we'll keep moving. Go smash those last remaining archers, because 13 of them, they're still managing to do damage to my to my guy. See, that guy was killed by those archers. Now, there's only one left. Surely you can kill this fuckhead. Or capture him, whatever. Same shit. Overall, I'm pretty happy with how this is going. I really th I think we can do this. Okay, come on. What's going on? You must be... Yeah, he's more tired than them. If you reckon you can take them on, then do so. After all, we do outnumber them. Nope, missed. Good, broke their cavalry again, and this time got rid of them all. Come on, keep moving. I don't think he's exhausted. Armoured spearmen are on the way. Keep moving out again. Don't want those spearmen attacking us. Come on, just move out of there. of them left. All my guys are exhausted now, so, well, near exhausted. He's still catching up to me. The guy's not exhausted. Come on, kill him. It's just the general now. Fuck, it takes a lot to bring these guys down. Fucking hell. Surely he's at least down to half strength. As far as his hit points are concerned. But I outnumber him, what is this, 39 of my guys versus one of theirs. Or even just my generals themselves, three versus one. And even after he's dead, I've got to take out those armoured spearmen. Which in all honesty shouldn't be too hard, provided I don't lose too many more men from here. Come on, surely... One of them could have killed him based on that charge. These enemy generals are fucking tanks. Oh shit. Fucking out of there. Eventually I will kill him. It just seems like these guys have heaps of hit points. I mean, they can't have just done no damage. Enemy Finally. Slain. A worthy end. But no less dead for that. We must strike now while the iron is hot. Okay, this kills heaps of them. And it didn't. Not really. Oh, it did kill a few. Still. Hit and run tactics. Hit and run. Ah, oh, shit. Lost too many on that. Come on, 
break them. That was a pretty good charge. Still get out of there. Oh, good, it did break them. I'll send you to go run them down, because you have the least amount of men. So I can... Oh, fantastic. Well then. This settlement's mine. Enemy are utterly vanquished. This is a great victory worthy of only the. Oh, a crushing Thank victory. you. They must fear us now. Oh, all right. Well, this is one-to-one -one ratio. What are we up against? There's no artillery in this game. So, three generals versus three generals, and a shitload of infantry. No ladders, just one siege tower. I don't think this is going to be a huge problem. Let's get on with it. Now, the reason why I don't think it's going to be a huge problem is because of boiling oil. They're going to crowd around the, uh, the gates, and I'm going to keep holding them back, and the boiling oil will do the rest. That's what I think. Because I've only got one siege tower, so they're not going to be able to get heaps of men up there. They don't have super heavy shock troops. Okay. Let's see. Okay, infantry down here. At least you've got good armor upgrades. So you should be able to hold out okay. they come up here, I want to be shooting them. Hmm. Oh, this, what the fuck is this thing doing here? It's in my bloody way. Now, I'll have to leave my general here. But these two can probably afford to go around another way. And smash into the back of them once the morale is lowered. We'll see how that goes, and maybe even take out any of their missile units, once the fight's already started. You guys need to not shoot. You guys shoot your heart out, I don't give a shit. The reason why I don't want these guys shooting is because I want them to be able to kill them once they, uh, once they get up here. It doesn't matter if they take the gate. Let them come. Boiling oil will kill them. Alright, we need to get right up on that. Here. Right in its face. Have to keep as small as gap as possible. Now, unlike Rome 2, they can't capture this point. It would be good if they burnt this down with the te uh my flaming shots burnt that down, but whatever. Oh, fuck, that was asking you shall receive. Somebody above listening. <laughs> yeah, right. Why would he listen to me? Oh, that makes no sense. Alright. The enemy siege tower is just firewood now. He there. The enemy are battering down the gates! Nothing to be concerned about now without that. The boiling oil is going to annihilate these guys. Here we go. You guys hold your position. If you break, I'm going to be furious with you. You guys get your asses over here. Tell me that boiling oil is coming. Oh yeah. Men are winning the battle. If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy.
Hey, 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 hey. What do you fucking think you're doing? I told you to hold your ground. What the fuck do they think they're doing? Probably killing more of my own men now. Fucking retards. What a fucking mosh pit. That's a disaster. Fucking hell, you guys need to get over here. I probably shouldn't have set them up in a big group like that. That's probably my first fault. You know, pikemen at this point would have been good. Okay, one of their generals is dead. I think that's the main guy. So they should have fairly poor morale. You guys need to hurry up and get here. You don't get in this fight just yet. We're losing. You guys better stay steady, you useless fucks. Some of them are broken, that's good. Come on, hurry up. You guys can win this for me if you smash into the back of them. I should have given these guys more room to move. They've bloody slaughtered my spear infantry. Hurry up. We're losing. The walls are no longer ours. The enemy have taken them. Uh, that's not going to mean anything. Still, I haven't lost any of my good troops yet. Nor have any of my men routed. Thought them coming back. Thought it doesn't really matter. Their shit. All right, come on. Hang on, are they all routing? Come on, hurry up! Yeah, don't worry about chasing them down until the battle's over. Come on! Actually, looks like things are turning in my favour. Come on, in you go. Better be careful of the boiling oil, though. What are you doing? Come on, over here. Okay, it's turning the tide. Watch out for the boiling oil. The battle is very much in our favor. If we remain true and steadfast, victory will Come be on, ours. Inside here. Lord, be merciful. We have lost half of our men. That's okay. It's all just shit units anyway. Coming inside here. Looks like they're all fighting to the death. Which is fine. We'll capture these fucking general's bodyguards and kill them all. No King's Landing for you guys today. The Iron Throne is still mine. I'm fucked if you guys are going to get another opportunity to get here again. I'm going to destroy your fucking faction. Very lucky that their general died early. So I've got two more over here. You guys stop shooting. I'm getting friendly fire now. There's another one dead. Very good. And that's the other one dead. So all three of their generals are gone. 
Didn't quite destroy the army, though. Not yet, anyway. Almost. Alright, guys. Kill these stragglers over here. Eighty-five percent of this army needs to be destroyed, or else it won't be fully destroyed. Now it says that now, but how many actually escaped? Because they counted as kills as well. There we go. That ought to do it. The enemy are utterly vanquished. Yep, this they're dead. Victory, worthy of that went very the well then. Holy shit, they're not going to be able to afford that. France. And I don't want them to be able to. Don't give them the fucking chance. This here is going to be harder to win. I think. Much harder. I don't have... Well, I've got better troops, but they've got more. And I've only got the one general. Still, give it a go. It doesn't really matter if I do lose. Well, it does matter, but... It's not the end of the world. Take courage, men. God will be with us as we meet the enemy. Our foes appear to be gaining the upper hand in this battle. Alright. What are we going to do about this? So, this unit is knights. Ah, oh, shit. So they're going to send in their heavy troops up here. Well, I've got no archers, so I don't really need to take the walls. And I just send everyone over here. Do what we can. Simple as that. You need to stay here to give these guys morale. Ah, I forgot to check which general. That must be the general's bodyguard there. So he really needs to die. I mean, they can take these towers. It's not going to stop these shots from being fired. at the walls. Repel the attackers. Give them steel. Our cunning grave tidings. The enemy are at the gates. To arms, General. The enemy's ram has breached the gates. Let me just wait. Okay, so they've lost 4% no already. That's the enemy okay. Something changes in the course of battle, for defeat seems almost certain. My advantage over them is morale. I should have better morale, because uh, my general has more experience, and theirs is not even a general. Hedge Knights won't do too well against my Spearmen, I don't think. Not on the attack. How are we going? 7% of them killed to 2% of mine. That's okay. Could be better. Shit, these guys are coming in. What I need is for you to get back, General, and smash into them with a charge. We need to get over here for that. Something changes in the course of battle. For defeat seems almost certain. Everyone's still eager, so that's good. And I do have them surrounded. Come on, do a good charge. I 
need this. Oh, it's not quite going to work, is it? Oh well, you'll just have to fight them. Problem is, these armoured swordsmen, they're going to be very good against my bloody militia and shit. So that's why they need to die. I don't know which one the general is. Our foolish general has thrown oh, his life fuck, away that is not good. Our chances of victory with it. How the fuck did he die so early? That is very bad. Only intervention by yeah, this one's fucked. Lord or a military genius can bring us victory from this debacle. As soon as all these guys start breaking, I'm out of here. These guys are dead. I mean, unless I can kill their general right about now, which is fucking unlikely. So it looks like they've got me on this one. Not much else I can do. Just fast forward it. I mean, some of their guys are wavering and stuff, but I just don't think it's going to be enough. Yep, yeah, there we go. Mass route to begin. My guys aren't holding the line very well. Hurry up. This one's battle to be over. What are you guys doing? Get over here and fight. Only intervention by the Almighty Lord or a minute. Our army is tiring. Lord preserve us. We have been dead. Yeah, that's a bad defeat. Oh well. That's why you don't rely on fucking infantry or defensive battles. Not in this difficulty. Their troop quality was a lot better than mine. To the walls, our enemy has laid siege. Alright, we'll get to them soon. I'm the richest. Alright, well, I'm gonna have to sell you out this turn. Can't let them just sit there and rot for nothing. Alright, so they sacked the city. Doesn't matter. I'll be back there soon. Now, River Run. It'd be better if Stannis had a few more extra troops. These guys could use a turn of recovery, but I really do need to lay down the hurt on these guys. Same with Harrenhal. The Tullys really do need to die for this. Alright, well let's conquer this settlement. And then end the video there. The battle seems to be swinging in our favor. From well, this is not the place to be attacking from. Shit. Look at this place. I'm not sending them in. Send this guy because he's of low value to me. Go. Would have been easier if they sallied out, but based on the small army that they've got in there, that wasn't going to happen. Not unless I used that exploit, which, to be honest, I couldn't be fucked. What's this here? So they've got someone up on the walls. Armored spearmen.
shattering ram is in uh -oh. Soon the enemy's defenses will fall. Well, the good thing about this situation is the next battering ram that goes up there can't be burnt down by boiling oil. Because of the uh, the scraps there will take up all the space. It protects it. At least that's what I think. And even if it doesn't, I've still got ladders. They should be protected by that, aren't they? Alright, off you go. Go attack. Everyone else, get your asses over here. Same with you. The Lord is with us today. We have captured the enemy's walls. Battle is very much in our favor. If we <laughs> these guys are getting their ass kicked. Victory will be ours. Very good. They're coming off the wall, which means uh, no more boiling oil. Not that it matters. I was protected by that broken ram. They here. Oops. Come on, get over there. Everyone fights. Enemy general dead. Well, oh, very good. Alright, generals, get in there. I want this guy. Oh, he's broken. Come on, go. He's got a long way to run. So hurry up. He didn't even fight. Oh, you fucking idiots. Oh, you fucking idiots. This is beyond ridiculous. You haven't killed a single one of them. I'm just gonna micromanage you. Come on! Do as you're fucking well told. They get close and then they fucking stop. I know they're sort of overcrowded by their own bloody troops, but still. This is beyond fucking ridiculous. Come on, kill them. Okay, looks like we're getting to them now. Come on, I want them all dead. Better late than never. The battle is very much in our favor. If we excellent. Our men have taken control. Boy, that was close. Managed to get them all. The they won't last long. So let's go take them down. Come on, break them. You've got to get right inside their lines if you want to break them. There we go. Well, they're not breaking, but they're still dead. My lord, our men are in command of the castle. This is a clear victory that goes to only men of great virtue and valor. Very good. Very, very good. I'm pretty happy with that. And that makes up for that loss. That settlement's better, I think. 
Although, that being said, I still need to take it back. Very good. So I'm currently sitting on 26 regions. I still need to sally out there. Must make a note to do that. Even though I'm not too confident of victory. And there's no reinforcements that I can send to help. Anyway, that's the end of this video. So like and subscribe. Part uh, 10 is next. And don't forget to visit me on Facebook. I'll see you next time.